Let me demonstrate for you today a traditional blanket stitch. I'm going to show you how to do this stitch on a piece of doubled felt. I'm using a medium darning needle with some fine perlay cotton threaded. We have a knot at the end and we're going to begin come in at the back of your fabric. You want to exit your, exit your needle right between your two layers. Okay, pull your thread all the way through. I tend to wrap my thread over my index finger just to keep it out the way. It keeps it all nice and tidy. I'm going to do my stitch about uh, five mils. So five mils down, five mils across, that's where you pop your needle in. So straight through, all the way through the two layers and your needle comes out through the loop. You can see that the loop is what makes your little stitch across the edge. Because this is an edging stitch, it was traditionally used as a binding stitch, obviously, in blanketing. It's a very strong stitch. These days it's more decorative. Okay, so we're just going to watch that we're keeping our stitches even. The same distance apart and the same depth and as we go you can see that there's a nice little line happening across here and that's your binding edge. Now a blanket stitch should look the same on the front as it does on the reverse that you can see there. Now I'm going to show you how we go around a corner, a nice neat way to go around your corner. Okay we've got one stitch in here just as before. I'm going to lay that stitch straight as we were. Now we're going to go back in because we're right on the corner, we're going to go back into that same entry hole exactly the same way through both layers through the loop and this time we're going to position our stitch right on the corner. Okay, rotate our work back into the same hole And this time we're going to position our stitch just mirrored to the other side. And we'll, what we should end up with is a nice little point. It's the neatest way to uh, bind a corner. Now you'll find that now we just continue on. 5 mil, just like before. And away you go. And continue. Now I'm going to show you this stitch really slowly. So for the last time in our fabric right the way through make sure we're coming out through our loop and you can see that thread coming through that loop there. Okay and that little line has continued all the way around with a nice neat point at the corner. When you want to finish off we'll do one last stitch here Finishing off is just a matter of, I like to go pop my needle straight back in between the two layers, as close as we can to the stitch. I'm using doubled felt so I can go between the two layers and come out at the back. And we've made that a nice tidy little finish. Obviously, we do our usual couple of little stitches just to finish off. And we snip our thread. And that's your traditional blanket stitch.